You see, we switch seats Indeed. and cars. Because this is what we were talking about potentially going to do. So we are test driving a what, my love? Watch me. I'm absolutely not watching you eat. Watch me. Eat. We got food at home. Some greasy food. We got food at home. Um, yeah, I'm on this detox. It's not fun. Um, but she does it for the second time. <laughs> I said I was never ever gonna do it again, and here I am doing it again. Exactly because she just likes to put her. She's a glutton for punishment. Like, why am I doing this to myself? I don't get it. I don't know. Such is life. i tell you what, though. This one right here. What? Discipline. She has some discipline. Ooh, yeah. And we work and we don't. It's tough. Because uh, if you don't remember, it's no caffeine, no alcohol, no gluten, no dairy, no sugar. Um, and is that it? No corn, no soy. <laughs> Basically nothing. Basically nothing. <laughs> Meat and fruit and vegetables, okay? And nuts. Now, I haven't been eating these spicy nuts that I make. Oh my gosh, they're so good. She massaged them. <laughs> so, I was filming this video for the game <laughs> where I was talking about, you know, oh, just what I've been doing with my 75 medium and the detox and stuff like that. <laughs> And I was making the nuts. And she said, so she put all the seasoning on them. And then she said, now you're going to massage them. And I was like, I was standing on the other side of the room. I'm like, did she say she about to massage the nuts? <laughs> oh, it was the funniest thing. So I, I uh, looking forward to seeing her technique. That video <laughs> should probably up, be up by the time you're watching this. Oh my Maybe goodness. it'll so be up funny. by the time you're watching this. If not, it's coming up on the game. Massaging the nuts. <laughs> You wonder why the blog's called Massaging the Nuts. Well, then now you know. <laughs> why? Um, but yeah, so we are heading to do a podcast episode. Yes. Don't let me forget I got this scarf. I won't. Sweet. Okay. <laughs> we, uh, the, the lady that took our last pictures mm -hmm. is also has a podcast. Yeah, so she invited us to be on there. It's called the Scuttlebutt Club. Which is the funniest name to me. Oh, did she get it? Did she get it from uh from they uh, must have the had. Little Mermaid? They must have. Because where have you ever heard of where else have you heard of the scuttlebutt? I don't know. So yeah, we are going to be on there, which should be fun. And uh yeah. Yeah. That's what's going on and then and then we might be going to do something after that. Yeah. Something exciting. We got a lot of things going on today. We gotta get some work done. Yeah, we're gonna have a little fun. Gonna make out. We're gonna do all the things. Make out. So we're taking you with us. Okay, and make out. Yes. Thank you. Got Thank it. you. Jeez, add it to the list, girl. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> we never you used like the just DJI the mics. Um, and we were outside, so we were like, oh yeah. So we were concerned that like the ocean oh, sound yeah. was gonna be. And the sound was, was no the sound was amazing. Oh, we have yeah. those mics, don't we? They're actually really good. They like, were amazing. Yeah, yeah we, we just those. finished the podcast. I'm gonna have them introduce themselves. Oh no. So hey guys. Hi. 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 So tell us a little bit about the podcast, your names and all that good stuff. <laughs> I'm Taylor. Mm -hmm. I'm Caitlin. We're sisters and we have the Scuttlebutt Club podcast. Yeah. Can you tell us where the Scuttlebutt Club name came from? Is it a nod to the Little Mermaid? Yeah, a little bit. Ish. Okay. okay. So, go ahead. You're better at that. <laughs> I mean, she is. Okay, so the scuttlebutt, like back in the day, like long time ago, on old wooden ships, that is where people would gather to get fresh water. Oh. And then they would like tell of their voyages or like mm. the gossip, what's going on. That and then, like the modern day water yes, cooler. Yes, it translated over okay. to the office setting to like the modern day water cooler. Oh. And that's like 
this that's how like got its name like the scuttlebutt oh um, you watch the office i never watched i watched the episodes, honestly yeah. they like yeah. they always talk they about always start there. like so what's the scuttlebutt but okay so, that, so that's why we didn't get it okay so, okay the mermaid always knew like all of the gossip yeah. happenings on land yeah so okay that makes that's sense hilarious. did y'all know that because i didn't know that i mean i guess because i didn't watch the office Nobody knows but that. that's so cool no, so that. you guys can find them anywhere you find podcasts yes right yeah so scuttle the the scuttlebutt club so we'll put their information yeah. down below but thank you guys for having yeah. us <laughs> What it do, y'all? You see, we switch seats and cars. And cars. Because this is what we were talking about potentially going to do. So we are test driving a what, my love? A Model Three. A Tesla, the one of the new Tesla the new Model Threes, yeah. the Highlands. Um, I don't think the Highland is an actual. That's the name. yeah, it is. It's not. People just make that up. No, that's the name, sweetie. I promise it's not. I've watched so many videos, and people are like, "That's not an official." like it's a name um but yeah whatever, whatever. so um test driving the new tesla model 3 and it doesn't have any uh any, you do everything on the steering wheel and the screen yeah so, so i keep doing this trying to do the turn signals but it's all on there is the, no turn signal so yeah oh well, there is it's just a button though. it's just a button so let me show you all a little bit closer yeah, so, yeah there's, there's a steering wheel so that's just yeah so that, if i it comes up so now it turns on yeah yeah, so there's no there's no little yokes on there anymore, yeah. just the steering wheels, which is kind of nice. Um, but yeah, she cruising. Cruising. She cute. Do I like this car? I don't know, y'all. You like this car? Oh wow, jeez. Whoa. Oh, she I got. Get up and go again. Man, the power is ridiculous. That might be dangerous for me though. You can put it in chill mode. Where it won't do that? Yeah, you want me to put it in chill mode? We'll do, yeah, we'll just chill mode. Dude. So we'll put it in chill mode here. So you go dynamics, and you go to um, chill. All right, there Chill we go. mode means it just won't speed up as fast? As fast, yeah. Oh, so now okay. you're in chill mode. Okay. So now when you hit the gas, it won't speed up as fast. Okay. But don't do it right now. Though. Yeah, that's a car in front of me. <laughs> you're so I cute. I can do it just this mirror. This mirror. Okay. Boom. And then... Oh no, don't fold the mirrors. Mirrors, there we go. This car is not gonna Cause you just roll it, baby. Not stop pushing no, it in, bro. Roll was not working for me. I was wondering like why I can't roll it. Now I can roll. Did this one go down because it, it Oh it switched to right. Yeah. I'm gonna go all the way down. Yeah, it switched to right. Good. Cool. Yeah. Alright, good Thank deal. You. You're welcome. I feel like I'm back in my city. This feels very small to me. I mean, it is compared to my car. Well, yeah, compared to your car. That's interesting. You're so cute. I like I've stepped back in time. But you also know that you've driven a Tesla Model 3 for... I have for a very, very for long a, time. It's you, just been a while. It's been a while, yeah, exactly. I so. remember last year I drove it for like a couple weeks, I feel like yeah. it was. She, yeah, she drove. She drove for at least two weeks. Yeah, and she loved it. I did. Um, so she, this is, but but it's, it's been a while. It's an adjustment. Yeah. And so getting getting, and she doesn't drive my car very often either. So. So it's gonna be a transition for her, anyways. For sure. To go from a Jeep to a sedan. Yeah, I feel <laughs> like I've been trying to figure out: Am I gonna miss sitting up high? Bottom jeans. Right, I feel so low. Boots with the fuck. With the fuck. But yeah, so we rambling, but yeah. we are test driving the Model 3 at this point. Yes. To see if that's what she's gonna order. What will she do? Oh. What it do, y'all? Yes, we are in a whole different vehicle. <laughs> well, not a vehicle, different vehicle as like as in a different vehicle, but. Yeah, really. We never like, ride in the When is the last together? time you see me driving my car with the family? Right. It's, it's literally it, never happened. It's weird. Let them tell it my car is ancient. It is. And there's it no, is not. You're so funny. You guys. Nothing wrong with the Tesla. There's nothing wrong with the Jeep, you mean? I mean, no, I'm saying there's nothing wrong with the Tesla, so that 
that's that's not the reason that we're riding in the Jeep. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. We're we in the Jeep because we're going to actually shoot some content. Um, we're finishing some We've already done two reels and some stories, and we're finishing a third reel. So we've had a productive Sunday. Uh, and we went to church. Okay. Yes. Very, very productive Sunday. We worked today. We did not rest. We did uh, not rest. We did not <clears throat> The Sabbath was not yeah. going on today. And it was because it's because the, the brand that we're working with, it was a quick turnaround, so yeah. we had to unfortunately do work today. But well, it's yeah. a blessing it's a at the time. Turnaround from them and for me, because I get my hair done in a week. So I'm like Gotta get it done. Gotta get it to them to make sure they don't have any edits so that I can make the edits if we have any before I change my hair, my nails, all of that. All that stuff. So. Yeah, because brands don't often take that into account. No. Um, no. They expect you just to look the same two weeks apart. It's like, like uh, my facial hair grows. I mean, there's everything changes. Same. Everything changes. Are you gonna go? <laughs> okay. She, she jamming. Yeah. She wasn't steering, but she's she jamming though. She wasn't steering. She's probably driving with her knee. <clears throat> but must be. We do that um, but yeah, so. Um, that's what we're doing right now, and that's why we're in the Jeep because the scene that we're shooting involves her it's driving. Um, but yeah, what's going on? Hey, what's I been? just realized yeah. that we didn't. I don't think we finished vlogging on Friday. Well, after the <laughs> after Tesla the test drive. Test drive. <laughs> um, what test drive? Oh, mommy test drove the Tesla that she has been looking at. Yeah. So we went to the Tesla, and she test drove it. Undecided. I'm, I'm undecided. Are you more on the yes side or no side? I feel like before we went, I was on the yes side. Now you're on the no side? Now I'm on the I'm not sure side. Why? I don't know. Why? I don't know. I've, I've been trying to figure that out. Like, for how, one, how did it change? I don't know if I'm going to miss sitting up high like mm -hmm. I do now. You don't know. You won't. Somebody who ain't never driven a car. You won't. Michelle got a lot to say. You won't. Can you lift the seats up? No. <laughs> 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 you lift no, the seats up? He, said, he said, can you lift the seats up? No. He, she, no, I'm talking about, you know how how high my Jeep sits versus how low the Tesla sits. No, but, you, can, you can move it back and forth. You just want to be taller? You can, huh? I'm not lying. I'm not saying you're lying. I just didn't know that. If you get one, there's like this small little thing. <laughs> like okay. yours that are big. Okay. Good job, girl. The, the seat adjustment. The seat very adjustment. Because right. they do it in my car all the freaking time. Oh, they get in and adjust. Yes. <laughs> they be having the seat like up and just up, like hitting the window. It's ridiculous. Um, but yeah, so she's unsure about that. Um, not unsure about her wanting a new vehicle, but unsure of what vehicle she wants. Yeah, I just want to make sure that I really love it yeah. to get rid of my baby because y'all know I, lo I love my Jeep. I am tired of driving this Jeep, but I love it still. Yeah. So, <clears throat> I got to find something that I love more than it. Yeah. I was, we even left Tesla and I got on the Ooh, Jeep website. My mind went so inappropriate so, right there. <laughs> What? Oh my goodness. I don't I don't even know what I said that would even be inappropriate for you. No, you don't repeat. Yeah, I'm making like But I was funny, Ooh. we left Tesla and I got on the Jeep website. Jay was like, Are you looking at Jeep? Jeez. I was like, I wanna know what the twenty twenty five look like. Maybe they changed a little something. Did they change something? I don't know. They not out there yet. <laughs> they not out there yet. <laughs> it wasn't on the website yet, so it wasn't on that website. Well, I don't I don't know. But yeah, so sorry this whole scene, the sun is just trifling. It's just, just, <laughs> not the sun. The sun is just, just all over the place. All but, over the place. But yeah, so that's what's happening. We're almost to our destination to, to shoot this shot. And then uh, head back home. To finish one. To finish the other shots. <laughs> yeah. What up, peeps? <laughs> Y'all, happy Friday. I am headed to a wedding today. Well, this morning and struggling with life, y'all. I was trying to figure out what shoes I was going to wear. I don't know why I waited until 
this morning to do that and then I was like oh let me make a video and ask my peeps you know so I posted on TikTok and IG stories and it's like girl <laughs> what <laughs> you supposed to be getting ready my priorities be so raggedy okay like why would I take precious time to get ready and make a video because that's the content creator in me and I think I'm doing good so it says right now that I will get there at 10 47 the wedding starts at 11 so I'm actually proud of myself because I got up had the idea to make the video executed it and have my situation together okay now the only other issue is that I'm supposed to be going to pick up my phone at the Apple store today at like 1 or 1 30 I think my window is between 1 and 1 30 so I was going to bring a change of clothes with me and have my bag and just all the things that I need with me I did not get to do that <laughs> so I'm gonna have to rush home change really quick because I I, sh I will not show up to the Apple store in this dress I mean it's very cute but I'm definitely not showing up to the mall in this dress uh, to pick up no phone so hopefully the wedding is not more than an hour and I can go home and change because I'm not going to the reception so um, <laughs> I'm like hopefully I'll have time to go home and change because I just I can't roll up like this as cute as I feel I'm definitely not rolling up in the Apple store like this sorry the the car is blocking my the light on my face my bad but yeah I had to tell somebody how much of a mess I am this morning getting ready but I'm not gonna be late so that's progress right I feel like that's progress y'all let me know the wedding was gorgeous okay it was so beautiful such a fun wedding too I like when weddings are like you know fun funny the um so her dad officiated because he's a pastor and it, you know it was just a good time like we were laughing and cracking up so sweet um so now i'm headed home to change clothes very quickly so that i can go with babe to pick up our phone um i'm sad i'm not going to the reception i should have rsvp for the reception but originally i hadn't planned to go to the reception then space opened up for the reception and it was like last minute changes but i was like no i'm still i still had things already planned for today so but now I'm like dang I wish I was going to the reception because I didn't get to like hug her and say hi you know when you have like a they're having a private reception so they didn't do I thought maybe I don't feel like people do this anymore but maybe they would do like a what's that thing called a recession line so you could like say hello since everybody wasn't going to the reception so I didn't really get to see her um and like hug her but she was gorgeous uh so yeah, I am hot. If it's hot, I'm like, is the air on? I'm like, I don't feel it. I am, I am ready for fall, which is crazy because y'all know how much I love summertime and warm weather, but I'm just tired of all my summer clothes. I think that's all it is. I'm just ready for fall fashion. Like I want to put on a, a hoodie. I want to put on a jogging sweatsuit set something, a cardigan like a boot well maybe not a boot but you know I'm just I'm just ready to like layer up and switch into that mode but these 88 89 degree days won't let me be great it is legit hot outside I just be looking at my closet like I don't want to wear any more of these summer clothes <laughs> which is crazy because I love summer clothes um but here we are <clears throat> catch me in a couple of weeks and I'll probably be complaining about how the temperature has fallen so I guess I better enjoy it while I can all right so just in case you were wondering I went with the black heel because I went with the most comfortable option and I actually really liked it I carried my coach bag Thanks for all the votes. I appreciate it. And the gold heel would have been really cute, but the comfort, the comfortable one won. Mm. So. Mm -hmm. You're, like, oh, you're so cute. <laughs> Thanks, boo. 
Thanks. I'm not looking at her. Uh, I thought you was gonna give me a kiss. <laughs> I'm done with you. <laughs> All right, I've officially changed. Made it with bad. I'm mad she, I mean, she looked great in this too, but I'm mad she changed. <laughs> I'm much more comfortable in this. Come okay? to Apple in the. Uh... Yeah. I told babe we was vlogging, but I know he ain't vlogging nothing. I'm vlogging right now, baby. Nathan, what I'm vlogging you what right now. Means? But Whatever. I'm still vlogging though. It's a team effort, sweetie. Whatever. What is yours is mine. Well, no, no. What is no, mine is yours, and what is yours is yours. Not how it works, sir. I absolutely hate vlogging on this phone. It bothers me so bad. You're so cute. I don't know why we do this to ourselves. Why do we come to the mall to pick up these phones? Because I know it's going to be packed. It's part of the experience. Part of the experience. Also, when they ship them to your house, you have to be there to sign for them. That which and is, that is bothersome to me because I got stuff to do. I yeah. ain't got all day to be, they be waiting. Giving you like a, they be giving you like a 48-hour window. Yeah, it's like I don't have time that for that. Long, Just let me come and pick like, it we up. We can come within from Monday to Thursday. <laughs> be home. Right. What? 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Yeah, Just home. stay at home and wait because you got to sign for it. Oh, those must be the sports seat. Those that's are the sports, sports seat. seat. The yeah, oh, those are cute. Seat. That's the plaid, which is the know. performance. This is model three, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. Going to the promised land. Trader Joe. Was I just here last Friday? Was it last Friday? Yeah. What? Look at me coming to Trader Joe's. Twice in a week. That's crazy. Look at that. They yeah, used to come here. I used to come here a lot more often. I feel like I don't come here very often anymore. You, know. you want to grab a basket? You never know if you need a basket. It's just kind of it's the Trader Joe's spirit moves you here. You get a basket. What? We don't need no basket. You never know what we need. These flowers smell good, but I don't want them. I gotta get me some hickama sticks because them hickama sticks were so good last hickam time. Sticks. They were so good. You want the camera, you can have it. Be responsible, vlog. So, yeah, we in Trader Joe's. We just picked up our phones, got our phones, and uh, so we're gonna go home and set them up and then trade our phones in so we gotta bring them back in. But, uh, so yeah, we're trying to get our stuff. She's over there. You're so cute. What you finding? Huh? What you finding? Okay, oh, those These are good. They're so good. Yeah, those are good. I know the kids will probably eat them up. They'll be gone All before them. Sunday. Yeah. Very good, though. You're a gum drop, girl. That's <laughs> 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 Friday, 29th. What's the date today? Today is the 20th. She's so excited about these hickama sticks. They're nasty. It's, like jicama, it's not nasty. There's no flavor. It's a good flavor. It actually does have flavor. It's good. I don't know how to describe it. Though. Yeah, it's nothing. Don't be a Imagine eating a stick of nothingness, of, of despair, not despair. <laughs> and depression. <laughs> <laughs> That's what a hickama stick it tastes like. <laughs> exactly what it tastes like. Despair and depression. Despair and depression. You better get you some sugar snap peas. I don't know. Great question. A fun, crunchy snack. You're so cute. That's what it Oh, you're so cute. We saw we conquered. I know it's heavy, ain't it? If you know that we did not pick up a bunch of extra, well, maybe Babe picked up a bunch of extra. I did. I picked up a bunch of extra. He don't really be coming to Trader exactly. Joe's. So. so she brings me here and expects me to act right. <laughs> he, he was roaming the aisles, just putting stuff in the cart. Yeah, expect me to act right, and I don't be coming here, girl. It's like bring me to Disney and say, "Don't ride a ride." <laughs> Hilarious. Ooh, it is hot. Y'all, yeah, I'm so over it. So over this weather. They not real chomps and they not real olives. They are. Every time I go to Trader Joe's, I get the same, same snacks. My jalapeno chomps, beef stick, 
in these Manzilla olives. We don't have these olives. I told her. Told her they ain't Godzilla olives. Let me get one. You like green olives? Yep. I love green olives. I hate black olives. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's good. Some Godzilla olives are better, though. I like Godzilla. Some mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm trying to give them to you. <laughs> Not in your mouth. Yeah, girl. Feed me, baby. Yeah, I came straight in and did my walk. My 45 minute walk. Because. I knew that I was not going to, if I did not get my workout in, now it wasn't going to happen because I had to, I have to leave soon. So I'm sitting here trying to, yes, transfer. Trying to set up this phone. And I got a, um, what is this thing called? Privacy screen protector thing. I've never had one before. I don't usually like screen protect screen protectors, so we're gonna see how this works, how long I can actually keep it on there. But I like it because it's a privacy one. So folks can't be all up in your business, okay? Don't be in my business, please. Uh, I'm getting ready to read my ten pages because if I don't do it now, it's not gonna happen later. So I'm gonna do that. Siege got home from school and they just left and I realized babe did not take a camera so I'm gonna have to text him and tell him to vlog on his phone because they're going to get not a haircut but they're going to the hair dresser that not the hairdresser but it's where Siege used to get his haircut because I'm trying to find someone to just make it look better show him how to style it I don't know what to do with it quite honestly and he doesn't want it cut. You know, I feel like if she, she could cut it in like layers or something like that, but he still wants to be able to get it braided. So I'm like giving Chad all these things like, don't ask for her to layer it. If there's some ends that maybe need to be trimmed, we're okay with that. But like, I don't like, he still wants to grow it, but I'm like, somebody needs to show you how to style it because you're not about to be walking around here looking crazy about the head. So. I really wanted to go, but it's women's night tonight at church and it starts at 7. So his appointment is not until 5.30 and it's like 25 minutes away from the church. So I'm like, there's there's not enough time for me to go, witness everything she's doing and then get back on time. Rush hour, traffic, all the things. So I'm praying that he comes back looking decent and that she don't chop him up i told chad to pay attention so that he can show me what she did so we will know how to style it where it looks you know good i told Siege i was gonna have her give him a perm he was like what i was just so you can have curly hair you just need to get a perm and have curly hair <laughs> i can work with curly hair <laughs> so yeah we'll see what the finished product looks like. I took some pictures of him. I can't show you because my phone is doing something. But I took pictures of his before. I'll show you in just a second once this finishes. All my peeps in the place with a smile on their face. You know we keeping it real, but it's all heart shaped love. Gave TV coming at you.